Hello there, welcome back to Joe's Home Flavors. Today we're going to be cooking Spanish tortilla. So for our tortilla we're going to be needing uh, some uh, potatoes, some uh, onions, some eggs, a little bit of uh, chopped parsley, olive oil and that's pretty much it. Okay, so first thing we need is to um, get our onions going on our frying pan. So, onions on there. This is one big, uh, one large onion. Heat on, and we're gonna be needing some uh, olive oil. We're gonna need um, quite a bit of uh, olive oil because we need to poach our potatoes and our onions in this olive oil. So we're going to sweat this um, uh, onions for a little bit and then we're going to introduce our potato um, which will be um, cooked lightly uh, in, a very, in, a, in a medium low heat. So the idea is to kind of a confit sort of situation um, rather than, than actually frying them. We want them nice and soft, we, we don't want them crunched just, just yet. So as that um, onion starts rendering, uh, I'm going to crack these eggs onto our bowl. So on with the eggs. For this tortilla I'm using five eggs. <clears throat> I'm going to whisk these eggs. Back to our onion. Our onion is going great. Um, the eggs are whisked and now we're going to add a little bit of uh, pepper. Not too much, just a pinch. And obviously we need to season our eggs as well. Another whisk. <clears throat> I have a little bit of um, chopped uh, parsley here which I'm going to add to the eggs as well okay this is done now so I'm going to reserve that so the potatoes <clears throat> I've uh, peeled and uh, sliced the potatoes um, thin the reason we do it this way it's because they cook faster So we want those onions also to get soft so that we can we can then add the potatoes and then the, um, top it up with the olive oil so that we can um, obviously um, confit those um, those potatoes okay okay our onion is now cooked enough so she's just um, rendered a little bit uh, transparent and soft so we're now going to add our potatoes. The portions of, uh, of the recipe, like, like all the others, uh, it's gonna be on joesonflavors.com, so, so go on there if you want to, to have an idea of um, what sort of portions I'm using and what, what sort of portions you should be using. Okay, we should uh, add enough oil to confit this, um, these potatoes. Once you're done with this uh, oil, you can reserve it and use it um, for other dishes as well later on. You don't have to um, get rid of it. Okay. Now they will poach there. They will confit there. And uh, we will wait. Okay, so our potatoes have been uh, um, slow cooking here on this um, olive oil. And you can tell that uh, they are um, to the consistency that we want because you can, uh, I can start smashing them with, uh, just with, uh, with my uh, wooden spoon here with uh, little to no effort. And this is, this is how we want them. So now we need to um, um, sift them, take them away and drain them from this, um, from this, um, olive oil and we're going to reserve that olive oil as well so uh, what we need now 
is to drain them together with the onions. Now get rid of uh, that um, excess olive oil. We don't want them uh, soaking. And now we will transfer them onto our um, eggs over there. Okay, and in they go. We will save this uh, for now because we're going to use that as well. And now we need to involve these potatoes in the and the and the onions in this egg. And we need to know if um, these eggs have enough salt. So I'm going to try it. Yep, that's good. Okay, now we let them sit there for a little bit. We're going to get this um, frying, pan, frying pan again to temperature. So we're going to take some of that um, olive oil that we use to cook the potatoes. and go to the, our frying pan again, just a little bit, reserve again. And now we're gonna pour the whole thing in there. Okay. Now we should give it a minute or so um, at high temperature. So it creates um, um, uh, a base for for our tortilla and then um, once we're happy that um, that base is um, coated so maybe a minute a minute and a half and then we bring it down again and let it cook for another three or four minutes and then comes the magic okay so our first minute and a half has been um, has passed which means that that uh, base is created so I'm going to bring it down now really down and uh, now it's a, on a medium low heat and it should cook there well and now it depends obviously how, uh, how do you like your eggs but it will um, um, it should be moist in the center it should be uh, cooked on both sides um, and then slightly moist on the inside so I'm gonna let it cook for another three minutes and then we're gonna do the, the trick we can um, make sure that um, that uh, it's not uh, grabbing onto the bottom of the of the frying pan and um, also if we just sort of um, push it down on the edges and shake it a little bit so to guarantee that um, it's not sticking because we don't want it sticking right so now it's been cooking um, for about so the first um, one and a half minutes uh, on a high heat and then we um, we brought it, brought it down actually um, um, quite considerably to um, to a low um, medium low uh, temperature and uh, it's been cooking now for about three minutes on that side uh, three to four minutes so what we're going to do now is to flip it. And this is the tricky part, but don't be scared because it's, it's pretty easy. So you need to make sure that you have a plate that is bigger than, than the frying pan. Okay, and then obviously you need to place it on top, hold it firmly and flip it in one motion. Like that. So we put the, another little bit of um, olive oil on our frying pan. So it keeps hot and slippery. And now we're going to get back uh, on our pan with uh, with our tortilla. So what we do is we push it to the ends of our of our frying pan. Okay, in one motion again, like that. Okay, easy peasy. And again, we need to push it like that. Make sure that it's not sticking to the bottom. You can see it's actually spinning. So if it's spinning, it means it's not stuck. 
Okay, another couple of minutes have passed, so um, I'm pretty satisfied that my tortilla is made and it's complete. So now I don't need to tr I, I don't need to flip it again. All I need to do now is to transfer it. So again, one motion like that. Okay, and we're done. So I'm going to serve it now, and uh, we're going to try it. Right. So let's try our. Tortilla looks good. It's um, moist in the center, as it should. Uh, it's not too dry. Um, let's go. Mm. Really nice, as it should be. Look at that. Those potatoes, because they're confit on um, on that olive oil. They get so so nice, a bit like um, like um, dauphinoise potatoes. Uh, minus the minus the um, the cream. Really quick, as you saw. If you have potatoes, olive oil, and um, eggs in the house, you you're set for. Thank you very much for watching this one again, and uh, um, I hope you subscribe to to our channel as well, and. Um, Keep um, keep tabs on uh, on my uh, my new uploads. Um, I'm I'm bringing content uh, every week, so keep tabs on it. And um, yeah, uh, I'll see you on the next one. Thank you very much for watching once again, and uh, bye bye.